check my ears, please? Dr. Ellie, how do they look? Good. They look good? Okay, what about the other one? How's that look? Good. Good? Can <laughs> <laughs> you help me take a video? Yeah? <clears throat> Come here. Ew. Ew, you stink. <laughs> Ew. Did you just fart? Yes. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, Ew. Ew. Fuji. <laughs> Come here. So, I'm not gonna lie, guys. I woke up in a bad mood today and I did not want to record a video. But, I'm gonna record one anyway. And I'm gonna hope that my luck changes and my mood increases into a positive and vibrant mood. Right, Elle? Yes. You don't want to help me record? No. All right, well, my niece is running away. Anyway, speaking of bad luck, I do have an idea for today's video. Yesterday, I walked outside. Actually, let me show you. This is my 2018 Subaru Impreza five-door hatchback. I absolutely love this car. I love the color. I love that it's a manual transmission. I love the rims that I put on it. I love the grill that I modified and painted. I love this little spoiler slash wing that I raised up a little bit. And I also love that when I got this car, it had 16 miles on it. That's it, 16. One thing that I do not like, that I hate about this car, is that it kicks up rocks like it's its job. Check this out. I just noticed this today. That's all scratch on my brand new car. That is all scratches. That does not come out, ladies and gentlemen. I just got it washed today. That does not come out. So that did not help my mood today. But it gave me the opportunity to create, to create some content right now. I. I'm going to go to Pet Boys. I'm gonna figure out what the best type of scratch remover they have, and I'm gonna see if that scratch remover can take care of that huge, huge job. My hopes are not very high. I'm not gonna lie. But all I can do is try right now. So let's get started. Let's hope for the best. You know, a lot of the car people I watch on YouTube actually go to O'Reilly's. I go to Pet Boys as of now, but if I'm doing the wrong thing, please let me know in the comments. Let's see where these scratch removers are. You don't think those are scratches? You do a burnout? No, I, this car's a four cylinder. I don't even think I could do a burnout. Come in, let me give you the two things that I think you'll use. All right, I appreciate your help. That's a safety scraper. It's a razor blade that won't mar the paint. Scratch as much of it off as you can with that. Okay, and the scratch doctor. Yeah, try that. And yeah. What's the damage? 1704. Oh. Let's hope it worked. So I was debating on switching my store over to O'Reilly's, but I went into Pet Boys. I asked Dan what he thought. He walked outside, walked to my car, gave me his input. I mean, the guy really doesn't have to leave the store. His job is in the store. He doesn't have to do any of that, but that was really nice of him. Customer service was great. I appreciate that. He told me to get this scratch doctor right here and he told me to get this scraper that won't scratch my car so i'm gonna go home change the camera battery because i see that it's dying right now and we're gonna pray we are gonna pray that it comes out let's do this guys dan from pet boys said i need soap and water and a sponge for the scratches so this is going to be my sponge and this is going to be my cloth that i'm going to apply the new finish scratch doctor to this is the location of the scratches You see the left side, the right side. I'm thinking we're in luck, guys. All right, so you definitely want it wet when you're doing this. So I just hit the car with the safe scraper, wiped it down, cleaned it. Now it's time to look into this scratch doctor. But apply small amount. Oh, well, there's a amount. All right, guys, so I finished scraping it. I finished wiping it. And I'm not gonna lie, I had a very good scenario in my situation. I think I ran through something and it blashed all these hard white pieces on my car. And they looked like very deep scratches and they felt like deep scratches as well. Thankfully, that was not the case. I was able to scrape away most of it and buff away some of it, but I'm not gonna lie, guys, there's still some scrape. But compared to what it was, check this out. I lucked out big time. There's barely any white marks left. There's definitely some scratches. You can definitely see them in the light. But compared to what it was, I lucked out big time. And here's one thing I also want to add. 
since we're on the subject of the cars and scratches. I went through the car wash, an automatic car wash for my first time today. That's my baby in there. So I told the guy, I was worried about the brush. When you do a car wash and they use brushes, it's really bad for your car. The car will definitely get scratched when they use the brushes. But right off the bat, I saw the guy pick up the brush and start scrubbing my rims. I feel so bad for her. I am so sorry that I put you through this. I already noticed that this thing is gonna be scratched. They brushed the back of my car with a brush. They're hand drying with regular dish towels. That's gonna scratch the hell out of the car. And this is what they left me with. Look at those scratches, guys. Do you see them? Look at those. And these are the ones I just saw right now. I'm sure that there's more on my car everywhere. Do not go through automated car washes, guys. Bad, bad for your cars. Let's continue with the vlog. Rule number one if you don't want your car scratched, park as far away from the place that you're going to and avoid any obstacles that may scratch your car. This shopping car is looking suspicious right here. A gust of wind could push that thing all the way back. This front wheel doesn't even roll. Oh my gosh. I should have just threw it on the side of the grass. Oh yeah, yeah. Boom. I'm here at the gym. I'm about to get a good workout. And you want to know one thing that always makes me a happier person? <laughs> Seeing this kid's hideous face. <laughs> Let's get this workout going. It's going to be a good one. Back day, baby. Just got done our workout. I'm gonna head back to my house, get some food. Then I gotta go to Philly to pick up my girlfriend. Good workout. <laughs> 